Hi, my name is Andrew Stoltman, and I'm a Chicago-based investment fraud lawyer. Did you lose money with William Blair, the Chicago-based brokerage firm? If so, those investment losses might be recoverable through the FINRA arbitration process. Most brokerage firms, including William Blair, put a binding arbitration clause in their new account agreement with clients. What this means is that if you wish to sue William Blair for any reason, you have to do it through binding arbitration through a group called FINRA. Each and every year, uh, investors file arbitration claims against their brokerage firms, including William Blair. Uh, now, the most common claims against William Blair in each and every year, first and foremost, are a suitability claim. And what that argues is that the investments for the investor were unsuitable given the, uh, given the client's age, financial resources, and actual investment objectives. The second most common claim against William Blair in any given year are churning claims. Churning claims argue that the investment activity in the account was too aggressive and designed to benefit the broker instead of the client. A third claim that can be made are unauthorized trading claims, meaning the broker didn't get the uh, proper authorization for the client prior to making the transaction. And fourth is a misrepresentation and omission claim, arguing that the investment risks weren't fully detailed for the client. Now, there are other claims that can be made, including claims related to failure to supervise, breach of fiduciary duty, negligence, and other similar claims like that. We've sued William Blair successfully in the past. If you go on our website at www.investmentfraud.pro, you can see some of our results. And if you would like a free evaluation of your case by an experienced securities attorney in suing William Blair, please call us in Chicago. Our phone number is 312-332-4200. That's 312 332-4200. Thank you.